Lakey Lakey heading up top to go link up with my guy who probably arguably in my opinion that I think my head has the cleanest M340 I've ever seen in my life like I've never seen one better than this and it's such a simple setup he's been on Amos channel he's been on my channel before uh, you guys probably know who it is but you'll see when you get there got some fire cars out here Little Ben's Koopy Koopy. Ah, these bumps are a little sketch. Oh, look at that. XM. It's my first XM I've seen on the road. New BMW truck. Yo, it's like, it looks so dope in the first end. It's like, what the back look like? Just like an alien head. Rip AMG. I see the plates. <laughs> See, it got me a nice little spot. I tried to park in front of the um, XM, but he pulled off, which absolutely sounds like shit. Sad to say. Looking clean. Shout out to my guy, by the way. I got to put him on. 360 detailing for getting me all the way nice. You see in the beginning, he washed the car. It looks crazy. Just look at it. God. Feels good. Damn, Lexus, you killed it for me. Bro, didn't even What's good, five bro? Five minutes. What's good? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I switched up quick, man. Yo, I'm so glad I got my car washed for this. I ain't gonna lie. Why? Because everybody else's car looks always this clean. Mine be looking filthy. Bro, I, I, I got it washed like 30 minutes off. ago. It's, it's still wet. God, I looked at your car. I'm like, damn. Yeah, I know. It's exactly. It's, it's exactly. It normally looks like trash. Bro, I, I finally I'm washed it, and it looks good. You're doing the car injustice now. I know. That's what I be saying. Like, my back to back look fire. I already told him this is the best M340 I've ever seen in my life, bro. Uh, bro, I don't know. Name, okay, so name one you've seen better then. I don't know. Especially on the East Coast. Uh, I mean, you got fresh kicks on the West, all right? But geez. but on the East Coast. But everything is simple, bro. But, but that's what I'm saying, and that's how you need it to be. I mean, you might be right. Well, I got, I have three versions of this. So this is version one for now. Oh, God, bro. you were aiming with it. This, 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 this must be a North thing. This must bro. be like a... Uh, this is version one, so maybe V3 might be back. To yeah. To be honest, V3 might be back. Bro. But I don't, I don't really see myself getting rid of the car, so that's yeah. why I entertain different ideas and Not different it. versions and everything. But other than that... This is fine for now. I spent a lot of money on this car already. I had it since November, so. Yeah? Uh, so how, how much was the car? 68. 68. It has everything minus the self-driving thing, yeah. whatever. But it has everything else. Um, it has the upgraded leather. It has the shadow line package. It has heads up display, all that good stuff. Oh, and the cooling package as well. Top tier, bro, top tier. The Dravid gray paint does it. But I'm gonna be honest, one of the main reasons I think this is fire is because I think this is what the M3 should have been. Everybody hates what I say, but check this out. Uh, the front, this front, nobody agrees with me, but it's okay. This front is good for the coupe. I think when you put it on a sedan, it doesn't look as good as the M340 does. I, I think I, the M340 looks better. The, the front, the grill, every, it stretches out. I like it. It's like yes. a two door yes. kind of thing, right? The long hood, everything like that. Now, the three look fits the three. Like if you put the M340 look on the four, it wouldn't look right. No. You get what I'm saying? This with hips, bigger fenders, I know. front and I rear. Know. That would make a huge bro, difference. <laughs> bro, I'm telling you right now, nope. this, it would be better than the M3. I don't care what nobody say. This is about to be the thumbnail. Yo, watch out real quick, get out the way, bro. About to be the thumbnail right here, bro. I got this thing is freaking sick. Not a couple things, but like two things. Bro, it's right. perfect. Like I wouldn't do anything else. I'm glad you didn't go overboard with the carbon, because people no, think carbon I, equals success. I hope the camera could pick it up, bro. This 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 is sexy. Look, 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 you got me doing random B-roll. Look at that. <laughs> this thing is sexy. I love how aggressive the front headlights are. Yeah. It's crazy because I ain't even gonna lie to you. There was a time where 
I would be scared to come out here with the camera and, and record and especially hold it to myself like this Bro, that's as me. I'm walking around. That's I'm why. Like, yo, nobody. But now I'm like this. I don't care. People can look at me. I don't care, bro. Oh, walk on the street with me, bro. Look, he's like, I don't want to do it. <laughs> bro, that's why I haven't, believe it or not. Oh. So I made, I made the YouTube because somebody even asked me outside. They were like, oh, you're going to start a YouTube channel on the building and everything mm -hmm. like that. Oh, you gotta really gotta build it up and just say you're gonna jump into that. Yeah, you I, I haven't got, bro. I haven't gotten there. Bro, I don't know why, man. People, people I don't know why I'm People are gonna look. People gonna look. But you know what I've noticed? They're not looking to make funny. They are looking because you're doing you something. Well, oh, now everybody does it. Like they, they should know exactly what's going on. But like they're looking because they don't know what's going on. They yeah. don't know. They wanna know why everybody is that camera know. in front of this guy's face? Yeah. Who is he? Why is he so important? And somebody's holding the camera in the face. Yeah, right. But what they don't realize is we just a bunch of nobodies who like BMW. Exactly. That's just yeah. what it is, bro. You know, you just gotta have that confidence. Confidence, bro. Fuck around, get demonetized. Yo. Look at the. Ooh. Ooh. I gotta get some B roll of that bad bitty. Couple revs closed, a couple revs open. Is that, yo, that's closed or open? Damn, bro, that's just loud. The back, I think, is the biggest disappointment because it doesn't look aggressive at all, but then again, you have to think about it. It's not an M. It's not an M car. So it's like, and I'm, and I'm, I'm talking about not aggressive compared to an M car. So that's saying a lot. That's saying a lot. It looks super aggressive when you compare it to just regular cars you see in the street. The pre-LCI M340 though, I think looks more aggressive. Like if I look at my older one or Jerry's older one, I think the tail or the little things were right yes, here. They, it if looked. You could take this if you take the pre-LCI bumper, throw it on here. I feel like it gives a much overall aggressive look. Yeah, I think that. Like, I think it will prefer protect this one at least. Definitely has that throaty B58 sound, bro. <laughs> Catless downpipes? No. Okay, okay. Catted. Bro, definitely sounds better than my car. Hey, we got the big ass map up here, too. It's very smooth. Like, getting in these cars made me realize how, like, Jari the M4 is like you know a lot of people comment they hate it the X3M the M5 they say it's too too Jari too uh too like when you hit a bump it's like bang you know I forget the word for it yeah uncomfortable rough you know what isn't they mad even the like yo my car is just so violent now this is stock so if you ever ride in Jerry's car it's like sickening how it launches bro. <laughs> It's sickening. It launches yeah. so f aggressive with that electric motor. Nice and vibrant, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Let's see, let's see. There's all this. It reminds me of a Windows computer for some reason. I don't know if it's the blue or the red. Hey, BMW. All right, BMW. Fail. Hey, BMW. It be doing that. See? I was go. trying to do that. Just, oh. you know, but you know, it's a fail the time. <laughs> One thing I noticed though, I wish they could go a little bit closer. I'm pretty sure they can to the bezel, so it's like yeah. straight off the cliff. I'm sure. The the thing is, is there's not a lot of um, coding yet for this. So like, if you wanted to do like and play it with the YouTube yeah. or something like that, you can't do that. So. You know, I'm actually surprised because I was thinking that they would start making skins for it. Like for instance, on my car, even this car, you could change the dash to a whole different. Like I would like that. I would like that if there were whole different skins you can put, like fake Aston Martin, Ferrari they dials, like that'll be sick. They ain't do that yet. They gotta hack into no. the system somehow, <laughs> but it would be really, really, really crazy if they could merge that. I mean, I'm pretty sure for like legal purposes, they can't, yeah, you know, like it, they have to leave the instrument cluster to itself so they can't say they're distracting you. I don't know what the reality is of it, but- um, It's always something, you know, always something. But this is dope. You have so much more room, yeah. bro. It's like a little ledge right here. 
Like you could you could fit something on. I don't know what you're gonna put. I mean, like a foam mount. I thought about putting a foam mount here. Yeah. I don't know. I I see. Nah, why, this looks too clean. I see why BMW did it. It's for obviously it's for the clean look. And yeah. Like that. I yo, what's you, even missing? A freaking <laughs> yo. Yeah. So this I've I've um Facebook I actually seen a couple people change this out. It's a mm -hmm. plug and play. Um, I don't know. I think I read yesterday. Some people said you had to code it, but I read somewhere else you don't have to. Mm -hmm. So if anybody wants to change this over, you can change that shifter too. Yeah. Um, Shout out to Dale too. Oh yeah, Dale got if you. You know, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Even Hellcats need yeah. this. <laughs> but yeah, bro. I mean, to be 100 percent honest, I'm one of the kind of people where you just gotta you gotta get with the times. I mean, you seen a little Porsche, little razor shaver looking thing. It's like you just gotta get with the times, bro. This is bro. what it is now. This is crazy. This is like the the real estate. Let me see back here. Like, yo, what? So in let's a come for it and they'll show you. In story. a three series, like this is this is crazy tech. Now I read an article. Oh, the other day, the new C63, the W206, I guess you call it, <laughs> the new C63, the sales on the new C-Class is horrendous. I, I, yeah, Nobody oh, yeah. wants them. That's that four Mercedes four is going back to a eight-cylinder. The they going back because nobody don't want it. Bro. It make more power. Think about it. Yeah, Benz, everybody in you, you got Audi with the, what they got, the RS. Benz, Audi don't really have shit. What Audi got for the M340? They don't have it. The S4, they have the S4 the S3. which I've driven as four beautiful car. I, I'm not gonna lie to you, but I really, if I had to choose between the two, I'll pick Audi. The Quattro system my dad had, um, had I, Audi. between Audi and M340. No, no, not the hell, wildin', no, what not? Wildin', bro, what and Benz, yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Audi sound system's top notch, it yes. beats anything I've heard, yes, and their interior. I mean. To an extent, it's also movie theater in their cars, but yeah. it, it looks nice. It makes you feel comfortable. It still give, it gives you that premium luxury feeling that you spend on, on a Benz. Yeah. You know? you know, BMW pay for that performance. You may get the looks and interior and everything like that, but it's still minimal compared to, to Benz at the end of the day. Yeah. I consider getting rid of my, my M4 for X5, bro. The new one, yeah. I can't afford the M, but the new X, no. bro, beautiful, bro, beautiful. Listen, their cars, are like, they make a nice car. I've learned, I've learned, I've learned what I want. After being in so many of these things, I've learned, man. What I've learned is that people just, uh, it's either you get it or you don't have it. Yeah. And then that's when people who have it Bro, you confused me. You said you get it or you don't have it. No, no, yeah, I know. I'm about to say, bro. Don't put that in there, bro. Don't put that in I don't know if you see my videos, bro, but, uh. I'll be violating. Especially if I had a comment about it. Yo, don't say that. Going in the video, my guy. I mean, it yo, it's funny. Yo, you know how many people hit me up after they see the video, right? And n none of my guys or whatever, but like, like random people I do videos with, they be like, yo, Mike, I didn't know you were going to put this in the video. Or I didn't know. Or no, one chick, bro. Oh, my God. I had to scrap the whole video because she just got, got me a little too annoyed. She's like, oh, I didn't know you were going to put my face in the video. <laughs> bro, I'm like, you seen the camera pointing at your face. The camera all up in my what face. What you <laughs> thought I was filming? I was filming everything. But what you thought, like, what you thought I was going to have you headless? Literally in the middle of the street. I think this is good right here. But yeah, now they be wilding out. I, I'm not going to lie to you. I do most of my spirit driving when I go out. So. Yeah, you got to do it. Oh, let's see back and a little bit. When nighttime, that's when I be doing the rest of my shit. <laughs> well, okay. I'm just chilling. Bro, believe it or not, this is the first time I'm in a uh, driver's seat of the LCI version. You're welcome. <laughs> you're welcome my guy. Gotta bless you one time. Alright. Oh, that's another complaint, but we'll talk about that later. That's not actually not bad. No. You have auto holder here. That's that's what really counts. No, I'm talking about like going from Wow. I'm gonna tell you right now. Park to neutral. Yeah. This uh, is this the same steering wheel in the uh this is the same steering wheel in the uh, M3, right? In my car? Yes. Same, oh, effectively. Yeah. It's different. I'm, I'm gonna buy, if I keep my car, if I decide I wanna keep it, I'm definitely gonna buy a new steering wheel. I have the steering wheel. Yo, like, oh, I, nice. I love the fact, like, I don't know, maybe I eat too much uh, greasy food, like chicken or something. <laughs> Bro, my steering wheel is black and shiny, like the typical BMW black and shiny. <laughs> I hate it now. Some guy pointed it out in one of the videos, and I mean, like low key, they be haters, but like this dude was right. He was a hater, but he was right. That shit looks terrible. Oh man, yeah, it's just it's weird getting the seat position right because when you used to the buckets that you sit in, yeah, this feels like I'm sitting on top of the car a little bit. 
Oh, thank you. A little Dodge Dart. Let me go. Oh, yo, yo, I was ready. Yeah, right? <laughs> yeah, I ain't gonna lie. It's, it's weird. It's weird. 12,000 miles on it, right? Bro, more. This when thing I first is, got it. I kind of feel like I keep constantly wiping my hands yeah, because, like, weird. I don't want to. Yo, you got to see my wheel. When you see my wheel, you're going to be like, wow, <laughs> this nigga Mike is like, like, hey, no, <laughs> he's getting french fries too much. But it's pretty good. All right. And I'm feeling a little by roll. It was, it was a sports setting at for the suspension. Yeah. Is, is it adjustable? Let me see it. Put it in. Oh, you do notice it. Wow. Instantly. The heads up display did some trickery. Am I going right or left? Left. Left. Down, down shifts. You can get on the screen. Oh, yeah. Yo. This is where you can tell the difference between M car. Right. Honestly, bro, it did sharpened up. I don't know if it's because it's a new car, but it's pretty good. It's sharpened up a lot. I can smell the electronics on this GoPro frying from the inside. <laughs> All wheel drive? Mm -hmm. Nice. A little on ramp action. One thing I realized that BMW does, I don't know if they, they tune it or who, ZF tunes it. Yo, the transmissions, like, this is the best transmissions, I think, left or automatic. Like, you don't have to put it in manual, but if you do, it's, I mean, yeah, I mean if you leave it in automatic, like, I mean, you, you can put it in manual is what I'm trying to say. Yeah. But if you leave it in automatic, it's not it's a bad, yeah, it does exactly what it's supposed to, when it's supposed to. Sometimes I'll even notice a better acceleration jump with an automatic because it downshifts to that perfect gear, which will be second gear, but I'll be thinking it's third and I'll do a pull in third. Yeah. So shout out to BMW for that, man. And that fake X6M. You be noticing them fake M badges from miles away, man. <laughs> And some people would argue, oh my God, why would they put M badge on an M340? Okay, we all know they changed it to M340. They made M340, it's marketing. But I'd say these cars kind of sort of deserve it because they, well, one, they don't make a, a non-340 variant, like a non-M340 variant no more, it's just a straight M340. But it's a huge difference. Like this is not your TRD Camry. That's no, really, no. Yeah, yeah, like this is not like a, although, a blackout Ultima package. Although. <laughs> they are nice, but what I'm saying is like, there's actually some performance bits in this car too, like a sport tuned suspension or M tuned suspension. It might not be as aggressive, but you need that happy medium from M car. Cause I think I should let you drive the M. It's like, you'll yeah. feel what I'm talking about. It's not soft by any means compared to this. Not at all. Like you hit the gas, it's totally different. It's real drive, so it's a little scary and it's tuned and it got E50 in the car. So it, it makes a decent amount of power, but we drive these cars, it comes with a wrist, right? Yeah, <laughs> but it's like, bro, it's, you, this is so smooth. Oh, What's that? Oh, okay, so you put it down one more time for sport. See, this is the type of, yeah, you just. Yo, it's weird. <laughs> you know, because I've never felt, like, this is a gutless B58. Like, it's stock. <laughs> like, I punch it. I'm used to driving Jerry's car or my old M340, and they go like you send a DM in, bro. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I have to send a DM out. You don't feel the speed in this that much either. That's no. what's good. No, you. Bro, I hope I'm not destroying your wheel, bro. No. <laughs> I'm gonna start driving with gloves. You're one time. <laughs> you're yeah. Not good, bro. I'm just saying, bro. Listen, the car is. This is. Yeah, touch it and everything. Man. How you gonna drive it if you ain't touching it? Nah, you know, <laughs> I know, I know. This is. I like it though. I like what BMW did with this. Especially in a truck and stuff like that. Oh, really yeah, nice. Honestly. I just don't know about the M car having it, you know? Yeah. See this trans just downshifts for it it knows what it knows what to do. Like if I stab it, it's probably gonna be second gear. Look. Oh, third gear. It might be tuned a little different for this because you guys got more down low power. Yeah. Let's make sure there's no police behind us. We ain't even going crazy over the speed limit. I think those days for me is over. Mm -hmm. Not well, not really, you know what I mean. <laughs> Especially other people's shit, bro. I don't know. Mm -mm. Nah, you can't go wrong with this car, to be honest. Like, you can spend the money, get a 2020. You can even get a 22. To be ah, yeah. But if you want this is this look, is this is dope. Look, yeah. yeah. You, you gotta get the. Guy, you know? I like when you let off. It has a little burp, like the little. Oh, but at the 24 too, they raised the price on everything. Yeah, bro. I was looking at the prices on the M2s even are raised. Yeah. I like that little blip. Yeah, that's why I'm like, when it comes to tuning IMs, I'm 
And you know what? I'll when say. I'm around everybody else, I'm like, Shit. I'll say this, right? I don't know. I'm pretty sure it voids the warranty for a lot of things, but I would try a transmission tune first if they have it available for this car, because I did notice a difference on stock power and just a transmission upgrade. The the trans is so much more responsive. It'll make the car more enjoyable. Because let's be realistic here. This is enough power for like everyday, everyday driving. driving. I'm just so used to driving something like that blip. I don't know if you can pick it up on camera. Like you hear like that little, you hear a little, as soon as you get on the gas, it's like, broom. Nah, you don't need, hold on. Nah, it's only in the car you hear it. Like, you you, you hear what I'm talking about though? Nah, I know you said, yes, of course I like that car. Of course I know you Yo, this shit is nice. <laughs> and when the car is like hot, hot, you downshifts thing. Oh, it burbles the downshifts. Yeah. And this with the exhaust valves open? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. I like how you don't hear a lot of fake noise in here. No, I turned it off. Oh, okay, okay. That's so what I like too, yeah. All you hear is everything from the Yeah. My car sound like you're playing Gran Turismo. Nah, no, I when I first put uh my downpipe on, I was like, oh it sounded great, it sounded amazing. How do you and tell how much gas you have in this day? Okay, down here. Okay. I was like, what the hell? <laughs> I looked in the menu, I was like, oh, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bro, this thing is nice. I gotta play with the screen a little bit. Yeah. Um, I don't want to yeah. touch it. It looks so crispy. Nah, you good, bro. Yo, listen, my, my my hands, bro. You think that it's just so fluid? That's what I like about it. Where's the exit at, by the way? Oh, uh, next exit. Okay. Next exit. But yeah, it's so fluid. Spotify, my man got the Spotify. Yeah. The I, climate. I, people. I, everybody. I mean, people use CarPlay. Mm-hmm. I think they did well with iDrive. That little. So like I use I use everything from this. I use the GPS on it. I use Spotify. Like everything's logged in. It works well. Now even when people complain about the climate thing. Now this is I bro. Do not complain about. Just this. get with the. Th oh, you own it, but I'm just like give it the time. Nah, bro, like. th th this this can be annoying because sometimes if you really just something's going on or whatever. Like, you you know, know what I would say? I understand. I get it. I do because in my car you have the volume. I meant the volume. You have the temperature up and down stuff. However, whenever you want to go into the menu part to change the, I'll, I'll show you what I'm talking about. It's kind of weird, but sometimes even without the temperature thing, you have to change the cold and hot inside. Yeah. The old BMW used to have this little knob up here. That's there already. You well, they to going in the menu to change that is annoying. It. And going in the menu to synchronize the temperatures. Yeah, I, I, okay, I get it. It, it, it. it can be annoying, man. It, it honestly is. It's Averaging 15.9 miles per gallon, bro. Well, yeah, you be on the gas. Oh, this trip. <laughs> oh, I'm about to say. Um, I think I averaged like 23. I ain't gonna lie, I'm being a burble boy right now. <laughs> uh, on and off the gas, these pops. Can you hear it? If you put it down to like second or third, it'll even think it more. Accelerate. Oh, it's weird, bro. It's weird because it's so smooth when it's fast, bro. <laughs> it's just so smooth. You launched this thing? Mm -hmm. You launched it before? Mm -hmm. How's it feel? Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> bro, what's, so this is the sport mode gauges? So those are the sport mode gauges. And I'm assuming, how do you change that thing? Uh, to go back to... Normal looking gauges. But it won't change. It'll just oh. It won't change. No, but I'm saying you could change. Oh, drop, drop back in sport, the, man. We get We look. getting off the exit. Oh, yeah. behind a bus, we ain't going anywhere. But, like, we can change the gauge so it looks different. So you can have it only on one side. Let me see that one. Uh, it's on the steering wheel. Oh, it's on the steering wheel? Yeah. What button am I pressing on the wheel? Uh. Oh, this? Yeah. Holy fuck. Bro, I'm about to so crash trying to figure this out. Let that's me park. What that's what I'm Let saying. Let me park, bro. Hold so, on. This is Oh. See? Shit, my bad. Wait, what? It just put the car in park by itself? Oh, you press it. I didn't even notice that. Everything's subtle in here, I realize. So. Yeah. Yeah, so if you wanted to change this layout here, right? You can pick what content you want to have on here. You have this. Uh, Same thing like the others. So it's a lot more customizable than mine. Mine is just you kind of stuck what you get. So you can change the layout of this. I'm oh, sure once they start, you see how it's wide, yeah. 
I think I ain't gonna lie. This second one right here is my yeah. yeah that's that's nice. nice. Yeah, because he used more of the real estate in the screen. And then heads up. But that's oh, the heads, heads up. Can they see that? I don't know. Probably not. But you just change everything that's like this too. So. Bro, that's sick. And you press this button. Yeah. That's I think I have this in my car, but Probably. it don't come up. This nothing comes up so fancy. And this is a whole different ball game right here. Yeah. So interior lighting, obviously it's the ambient lighting. Bro, this is sick. Uh, I ain't even gonna lie, bro. I don't know if I would like it for my M though, to be honest. I don't know, but this is sick. Like, I gotta get an X5. <laughs> so this is uh, um, the dynamic light. This this is like from the previous one. Yeah, actually. where you open it and it lights up red. And when people call you, it actually starts to flash. I thought something was broken on my ambient lights. The uh, weather up. Oh shit, this girl about to die. It's at 8%. Live vehicle view. So this will actually. Oh, like the systems and everything. Yeah. See, I would argue this is more complicated. Let me go home real quick. Yeah, go. This is more, I would say, more comp. It looks like a Windows thing. I swear to you, it does. Yeah, very, like. Right, boom, iPhone. Boom, boom. When in doubt. This is good. GoPro makes some good shit, but they be dying. No, I think not. You can make through a whole video for this thing overheated and died. Vehicle status. Oh, there's all this stuff, but you can also make shortcuts. It's never gonna be perfect. This thing is nice, man. My lip then knocked off my goddamn shoe, bro. Hold up. I said the damn thing did not. Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 that's cool. You, 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 you wanna aim with this, but yeah, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I'm glad I finally, I'm glad I cleaned my car because I would have had no chance. Look how excited I think. I would have had no chance, bro. It's still an M floor. <laughs> yeah, no chance. We're going to get up out of here, though. I appreciate you for coming out here to take the time and driving this car. I'm going to let you drive the M4. Probably not on camera, though, because the GoPro is dead. That's fine. So I want you to take it for a little spin, so we're going to see, man. Just a little spin. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Everything going in there, bro. Oh, wait. I hope, I hope you grab. Follow me. I on oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Blender Gray, B L E N D E D. Gray, G R E Y. <laughs> underscore. IG. Only IG. And I guess maybe I'll do the YouTube thing. I'll think about it. Ah, come on, man. Uh, he wants me to do it. Little something. Little something. Little something. Yeah, little something. Just see. Maybe you might, not, maybe you might like it. Maybe you might not. I know. Right. I'll try it.